Cindy Haval is a freelance columnist and correspondent for The Spokesman Review and author of War Bonds, Love Stories from the Greatest Generation. The view from her porch is usually sunny. So my husband got me a Wii Fit Plus a while ago. It's a Nintendo exercise game. You step on a balance board and it measures your weight, tests your balance, and tells you what your fitness age is. The Wii Fit Plus is an enhanced version of the original. I think the plus stands for extra frustration because when I stepped on the board, a message flashed across the screen that said unbalanced. As if that wasn't offensive enough, my Wii Fit age, 59. Since that birthday is still some years off, I might have muttered some choice words. I felt better when I discovered I could create my own personal trainer. I named him Spin. He's a little pale and pasty and his lips don't move when he talks, but he says positive things like, wow, you're really good at that. Of course, he said that when I was doing the breathing exercises, but it's still nice to have one's skills appreciated. My kids cracked up when I tried the soccer game and got beaned on the head by panda bears and shoes when I tried to head the ball. I think it's disrespectful for children to laugh at their mother when she's being hit on the head with a soccer cleat, so I stepped off the board to explain that to them. When I got back on, a message flashed. I know you took a break during this exercise, but don't worry. It will get easier. That's just disturbing. I did take the weekend off from the Wii Fit. Bad idea. When next I stepped on the board, the game said I was 65. I had aged six years over the weekend. But I'm not giving up. Sven is pleased with my progress. The other day he said, well, persistence isn't a problem for you now, is it? And that persistence is paying off. My latest fitness age is 38. I may never have the figure I had at 21, but I won't stop working out with my Wii Fit until it tells me I'm 29.